Um, and a crowd in front of all those 70,000 people, being London, it's the best feeling in the world. London crowds, they say, are so hard to please. I don't believe that for a minute. They're wicked. Excellent. Now, the single's gone absolutely massive. You know, the, the album's uh, got to do well as well. What, at the moment, is priority in your mind? Filling stadiums, making it records? Well, I suppose at the moment it's all a part of the plan of hopefully one day getting to do my own show. Um, and we're getting one step closer and hopefully the next single will be, well, the next single's out in September, isn't it? Hopefully that'll do as well as Mysterious and then the album and, yeah, I hope to fill out stadiums, mate. I hope you're right. I hope you're right. How long do you think it's going to be before you top build one of these things? Well, um, I think I'm doing my first headlining of a show in September and then if all goes well, February will be my first solo tour, so hopefully, mate. I hope so. Do you mind if I put these on again? <laughs> do what you want, man. Cool. So what about... Uh, the, you know, things like this. Can they ever get boring? Can they ever get, you know, one PA is just like another? No, I think um, when the crowd's good to you, and it, hopefully they always stay that good to you, it never gets boring. The only time it gets a bit iffy is if the crowd's not sure about you, and I suppose that's new territories all the time. That's always a new challenge, and it's always good, so for me, it's it's great. You're starting to lose your Australian accent. Well. I never had it, mate. You know, it's quite funny, because when I was in Australia, recently and they said oh you've got an English accent I said well you obviously weren't paying attention before because I always had one it's just a little stronger now that's all it's coming out of the uh, Londoner in here yeah well you know I am a Londoner by, by born and bred Hello, boy. Now, apparently things getting quite bad at the moment. You're still saying you've changed your address, you've changed your facts, <laughs> What's happening? I mean, you know, you want to How much of a pain in the arse is getting? Mate, it's not a pain at all. I don't want to move. I'm getting kicked out by the residents because they're complaining. I don't want to move, mate. I, they can come and stay in my, in my room if they want. Well, no, I didn't mean it like that. I meant they can come and stay in my house. There's no problem, you know. So, <laughs> oh, you know what I meant. Right. Absolutely no relation whatsoever. Oh, no, no, no. What can I call right, you? Rapper, singer, what can I call you? Um, entertainer. Oh, yeah, I'm a rapper, yeah? Or what? Uh, I'm not a rapper, no, 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 as well. I sing, I write songs, I um, actually sing them as well. And, yeah, there How many of these things have you done? Performances? Like Capital Roll shows? Yeah. Loads, I must count them. Really? Count. Yeah, seriously. Because I mean, you're not, you're not an angry, you associate with the, with it, you know, you're, always, you're one of these guys with the big thing, isn't it? Yeah. Onto. How, much, how much fun is this to do these though? Uh, it's, it's, it's pretty special. It's a great experience more than anything else. Um, it's loads of fun. It's really nice like, seeing smiling faces out there, people enjoying themselves, getting down with the music and that. Yeah, I really enjoy it. It's, it's good stuff. Playing along with Peter Andre, I've had absolutely mad. What's it like? Do you get hairs on the Mackie neck stick up when they start doing all that? Um, no, well, at, at first, no, I'm quite used to it now. You know, it's, um, He's a very, I should say, professional geezer. It's, it's, it's good to work with someone like that. It kind of rubs off on you, sort of thing, you know what I mean? But um, I don't really get nervous when I go on 